Hi everybody, Elliot here from East Coast Podiatry Singapore and today I'm going to be talking to you about diabetic neuropathy. So what is diabetes? Diabetes is a metabolic disorder whereby the body is unable to process, store and utilize glucose effectively. This leads to large amounts of sugar or otherwise known as glucose in the bloodstream. Diabetes is a very common disorder worldwide affecting the young and old. Here in Singapore, diabetes is an all time high. The impact this disorder has on people's lives can be devastating. Neuropathy is a complication associated with diabetes whereby nerve sensation is diminished and it can be diminished to a state of no sensation. It is often referred to as diabetic neuropathy. When excessive amounts of sugar or glucose remain in the bloodstream, it eventually causes damage to surrounding tissue, such as blood vessels, which are essential to supply nerve cells with everything they need to survive. Nerves are essential as they help innovate muscles, organs, and sensory feedback. When you're cold, your involuntary neural system works to constrict arteries to keep vital organs warm. If you step on something sharp, your sensory feedback loop works to tell your brain that something has occurred which ultimately brings your attention to the site of pain. However, in diabetic neuropathy, the sensory feedback becomes insufficient and individuals that do have diabetic neuropathy are unable to feel and pick up an injury. Because of this, many individuals with neuropathy develop wounds that only worsen as the body's ability to complete the feedback system has diminished. Over the years, medicine has advanced to a stage where specialized conservative treatments are being used for diabetic patients to stimulate regeneration neuronal tissues. However, this treatment will not be beneficial for all patients. If you are experiencing pins and needles, diminishing sensation, or any nerve-related sensations, it is fundamental to seek advice early to ensure successful regeneration can be achieved. As mentioned, nerves are important in telling us that pain or trauma has occurred, which then leads us to react accordingly. However, in a neuropathic patient, the insensitive foot does not exhibit pain. Thus, the lack of immobilization flares up the inflammatory cycle. It is very common sight. However, with the amount of awareness, most patients avoid surgery and even amputations because of early podiatric intervention. Therefore, it is so important that if you or a family member is diabetic, seeking podiatric foot assessment, look after your body and your feet and you can stay mobile and active longer. Thank you for watching. If you find our podiatry videos informative, please like and share them with someone who might find them useful. If you need to contact us or find one of our clinics, go ahead and take a screenshot now. To subscribe, you can click this button over here. See you in the next video.